I was ready, like ready for the semi final, so I got that today. I mean, you look comfortable all the way. Did you feel comfortable? Yeah, I felt comfortable, and I knew I had another gear on me, but I had a quick look around and I was clear, so I wasn't going to put my legs into a hole for no reason. And uh, what will you do for the rest of the day? And... Uh, probably just chill out, go for a walk, have a nap, yeah, watch the Netflix, so yeah, not much. <laughs> And you'll be ready to go for the next one? Yeah, excited to go for the next one. Thank you. Thank you. Do you feel like you're back to the level you were at in 2021 or, or better than that? Where do you feel I like you're I think I'm better at? than I've ever been, but it's about navigating these rounds properly and well. And um, last year I didn't make that final, so first step is to get into that final. Yeah. What do you think allowed you to get to that level to wait better than you've ever been? Um, I've been doing new training, completely focused on the 800 metres. Um, I mean, I've only been doing it for four months now, so. We're still learning about me and myself, but yeah, I think I'm faster than ever, so I don't see why I can't be in that final. Yeah, would you train more like a 15-8 runner before? Or? I was more 15-5K before, yeah. Five, um, okay. Chip Laura's incredibly well at that 15-5K and the 8, but that's where she goes to and that's what she's amazing at, so that's what I was doing, but yeah, much more focused on the 800 then. And how much did that win in London, you know, help your confidence coming into this meet? Yeah, massively confident. It was the first big race I've won in quite a while, so I think it's prepped me up well for this one. Yeah. Thank, right. you. Thank you.